Oh, right. Yeah, this is a uh, uh, PayPal from Dorfin. He said quite rightly that people are enjoying the Fugazi. And to be honest, I think this is another one of the bands new to this year, like new to the channel this year. And I just like, I just love this band. They are actually fire, like great musicians, right? But yeah, Fugazi rend it. Let's go. Why don't you come to my house? Why don't you drag me right out? <laughs> Best all the shit that I said, I'm saying. Why don't you cut up my mouth? And I don't care what you use. Just don't ask me to choose. I force the fear to allow you. That's not so easy to do. <laughs> but what I was thinking is that this band fits in on this channel on so many in so many ways but one that's becoming clearer and clearer as we go on is there another band where you just you can't expect what what it, they're going to do do you know what I mean because how it started 
to then the vocals coming in on its own. And it was like, it really had the thing of when you see people mixing an album and they turn all, like, obviously, which is what they've done, they've turned it down. But when you hear that, you hear it in the studio and you kind of associate that with a, like a, a, a stud, like someone sitting fiddling about. You don't associate that with the finished product. But the fact that they went from that big beginning then into that is I I don't think I've ever heard anybody kind of use that. And then to come back in how they did, like I didn't see that coming either. I thought it was going to come back in, like you had the little break for the singing bit. And I thought it was going to come back in as heavy as it did when it started. But it didn't. It come in just disgusting filth like that's where i started thinking like this band fits in because there was a zappa kind of thing there like a kind of like zappa have, has this ability to kind of make a song but then kind of you watch the song at the end kind of melt and then form to be the next track like and you can kind of feel it like and that's what it kind of give that kind of yeah <laughs> kind of yeah like as if it's it's all falling apart like but musically somehow but then to come back in also there was a I'm sure there was two notes in there I, I think in the second singing bit I can't remember, but there was two notes and it was giving me the vibe of a horror film or it was either a horror film or one of them classical pieces of music that sounds kind of evil. Do you know what I mean? Like, it was two notes, I think, that's it. And I'm sure it was the guitar. And it did have a kind of, like, yeah, horror. That's what I mean. This tune kind of went, every, like, a lot of different places. And then it had some kind of crazy punk vocals. But yeah, this tune was fire. This tune was fire. Yeah. I have to say, another band they remind me of, like, in in little ways, not the overall thing, but is Primus. Where Primus are another band where you're not, kind of sure what is coming next ever rush is another one they're all kind of different approach like different kind of sounds but it's that same kind of like unpredictability really yeah but yeah no i really enjoyed this this was fire this was a great tune Great tune. But yeah. That's the reaction. Sweet.